Gunfire erupted in three different neighborhoods across the metro early Tuesday morning. A total of five people were injured at three different crime scenes. All of the shootings happened within 15 minutes of each other, causing a mix of emotions and concern among neighbors. I think it's more sad than upset because there's a bunch of senseless killings and senseless shootings. Police say around 1.15 Tuesday morning, two men who were shot on Shanks Lane showed up to the hospital. Then five minutes later, another shooting, this time on Rockford Lane. Both shootings were in the St. Dennis neighborhood, the place Mary Hunter has called home for almost 35 years. It's a lot of things that have been going on in this neighborhood, and it seemed like it's just getting constantly worse all the time. Then 10 minutes later, police were called to North 34th Street in the Shawnee neighborhood, where they found two men shot. All of the victims are expected to survive. These young people don't, it seems like they don't know, they don't realize that they are just wasting their lives away. Shootings and homicides are up. There have been at least 179 non-fatal shootings and 72 homicides in 2023, compared to 161 non-fatal shootings and 67 homicides this time last year. Police say there are several reasons behind the violence, including poor conflict resolution, tension between violent groups, and other factors. It's called drill rap music. And what we're seeing is it's specifically targeted uh, to a specific audience about gun violence, period. And a lot of that spills over into social media. They say more must be done as a community to stop the violence. We have all types of programs that we have throughout our city trying to help mitigate this. But until hearts and minds are changed, this is where we're going to be. Jamie Mays, WOKY News.